I'm 23, and white chocolate is back to get this girl a taste of my milky goodness. Yeah! Hey guys, I'm Daniel, and I'm a sex offender. Uh, so hey, what's up? It's been a while since I last uh, made a video. Uh, I did have to recover from the Hot Ones video. And I was gonna make a video uh, at least two weeks uh, after that because I had to recover. <laughs> but um, also, i just been so busy, so overwhelmingly busy, of course. Um, so basically, it's a dating show where a group of people are gathered on a bus, and one by one, they all go out and go on a date with the person that's outside the bus. For the time you last out on the date, you get an amount of money, uh, like if you lasted 20 minutes, you get $20. But if you make it to the end of the date, you get to choose whether to take the money or go on a second date. That girl does not know football. Woo! This can lead to some pretty great uh, situations. <laughs> great situations that we're going to see here today, but also... Just the personality of Next is very... It makes it very apparent why people remember this show more than the others. I'll just go ahead and say it. Kirby girls make my junk twitch. So, I guess you just sold yourself to the next bus. Next. I like stuff that looks worn in and used. Vanessa was perfect for me. You have a really weak handshake, so I have to say next. You're really ugly, and it's your loss, bitch. This handshake felt like a limp. Next was probably one of their most popular shows because they had insane characters, such as, um, like, one of my favorites, Dickie. Dickie, you're up. <laughs> okay. I'm really hoping to make a good connection. Next. Too bad you couldn't handle the dicky. Any of you seen my last episode? Yes. Yes. All right. Piper in the house. Uh oh. All right. Do you feel that? But on the other side of that, you get comedy from the main person, who is the date I guess you would say. That's not a word. The person these people are going out with, they can choose to eliminate anyone at any time they want for any reason they want. Like if they don't like how you look, people get nexted immediately, like straight off the bus. Next! It's the next! But yeah, it ran for a while. I actually don't know how long it ran. Let me look that up. It ran for six seasons and had 288 episodes. I, I didn't even know that. That is insane. It only lasted like, it was only around for like three years? It was one of their hybrid dating game shows, and uh, it's one of their most popular ones, and today we're gonna watch an episode together. Um, I started this episode, and I knew it was the perfect one to, um, to do for this video. Um, I already watched a few others just to get the grasp on uh, the concept and everything like that, but this one is, um, I feel like it's gonna be a good one. <laughs> I'm Charity, I'm 24, and I'm already falling off the next bus! Now it's I didn't like that. That was, I feel personally offended <laughs> by that one. That was fucking weird. <laughs> um, I also feel like they just got whoever, they just cast whoever for these fucking shows. I feel like the casting call was like, could you scream really loud? How obnoxious can you be actually? How, like, could you be maybe a little racist even? I can't even excuse that it's from 2005 because people still act like this today. There are people that still like there are people that like are still doing that, but they're just like instead of being normal adults, they're like dating high school girls or something like that. I'm Anirudh. I'm 23, and once again, I'm bringing sexy back. I'm Sam, I'm 24. It took me a second, I thought, I was like, what the fuck is he doing? But it took me a second, um, okay. I'm, I'll, I'll do the joke better than he did. Um, I'm bringing sexy back. Do 
You get it? I'm Tremaine, I'm 24, and the last girl next to me was cold. So today I'm looking for hot, hot, hot baby. This guy over here, what the fuck is he doing with his shirt? I love, I want to know the process of even, like, making an episode of this. Do they tell the people on the green screen to just do whatever the fuck? Well, I'm gonna have some karate sex, you know? Oh yeah? What's yeah. karate sex? You wanna look, have a look at it? Do I? Okay. Oh, oh, oh come on, oh, what is this? Yeah. What is he doing? What is he doing? The fact that this takes place in 2000, like, whatever, um, it makes me, it makes me think of, this is just, like, a bus full of middle school dudes. They're, like, dressed like they're in middle school, and they're, like, doing, like, jokes like people would in middle school. Like, that's basically the humor of this show. I was in middle school when I watched this show. No wonder I loved it so much. Alright, guys, I'm on first. I'm gonna show the White Sox is special, y'all. I I'm so fucking glad this guy is up first, cause he is gonna get- He's going off of the bus in his underwear? You know what? Now that I see it, now that I see them together, maybe they're the perfect match. Maybe this was a good plan. Maybe he knew who this was gonna be, because he said he saw her fall off the next bus. Like, <laughs> this may be a perfect match. Let's see. They are going to be cheering you on while we watch you do your best fall in those steps. All right. That was weird. The twerking thing was weird. I wonder how- I wonder how they're feeling on the bus. I wonder if they're like, man, he took off all of his clothes and then he got off the bus and it's been 20 minutes. What could they possibly- he doesn't have clothes. What could he be doing? So dudes, what do you think how much he must have paid for the chain? How much did you pay for that sentence? <laughs> <laughs> No! That was such a bad that was I thought he would with how much personality he had getting off the bus and standing still, I figured a fall would be great. I figured he would he would put his all into it. He just kinda he was he just kinda slipped like this. What is this? I'm sorry. Next Sorry girl. He got nexted, so his immediate next, next, <laughs> he got nexted, so his immediate decision after being eliminated was to take his dick out? You're gonna go back on the bus with like five bucks, and your immediate decision is to get a sexual harassment charge after that. <laughs> He's chasing them. This is, this is like, this is like a case. This is like, this is a case happening in front of us as we, this is evidence. This is in an evidence locker. Last time was a minute. Today I double it. Bling. Oh, ooh, maybe you should definitely not call your date Jugs. <laughs> maybe that, he deserved to get nexted. I don't like this guy already, honestly. <laughs> Adam. Hi Adam, I'm Charity. Yes, you fell off the bus. Literally everybody knows her for that. That's her like career defining moment, falling off of the next bus. Imagine putting that on your resume. Every time people see you in public, they're gonna be like, hey, you're that girl that fell off the next bus. Could you do it again right now? And she's gotta fucking be like, That wasn't worth that. That wasn't worth the joke. I now my I I feel stupid. Hey, do I look disheveled now? Do I look disheveled? I do look disheveled. Right. 
show. Oh, yeah. oh. I'm good. I'm good. Uh, I'm sorry, Adam. There was just no passion. What? Next. There's no passion in the way you fell. I could tell that you did not want to fall. I'm not sure what she's like wanting exactly from uh, this part of the date. I'm not really sure why this is even part of the date, honestly. Do you want them to break something and maybe they'll like progress further onto the rest of the date? <laughs> You're like an ugly version of Margaret Cho. I'm glad you next to me. Wicked glad. You look like, damn. <laughs> Okay, uh, I I didn't like that guy, but that was that was that was kind of decent. <laughs> that was, I, I'm gonna be honest. Oh, talk about it. Talk about it. Do they just get free helmets when they when they like fail on this date? Because th these guys got two new helmets just from going on that part of the date. They don't even have to. They that's probably worth more money than they got from being on the date. He got like $10. Let's see how she handles Taj Mahat. Got nexted for not being rock and roll enough. I, I can see, I can see it. <laughs> it's a little, I'm gonna wear a shirt over my button up style. I can see why he was nexted for not being rock and roll enough. I'm gonna show you okay. what you're gonna have to do, okay? Sure. Hey, I'm your rude, I'm your getting funny surprise. You should have recognized who my exotic look at my if you ever buy anything from Apple, you should use... I got cut off uh, by an... Shut up. I got cut off by an ad. Um, I'm kind of glad I did because I don't know what was happening. <laughs> hey guys, look at my rap. I, it's my first time, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try and I'm going to win. I'm going to try. This is my rap and what? Yeah. Now listen! That's called motherfucking bars, nigga! Fucking you know nothing about that! That was that was bar after bar of greatness. You're going you're going up against like the likes of uh Kendrick right now. I just came last year. Here. Oh from where? Bombay. Oh. India. So have you been to Bollywood? Yeah, of course. Can you like do some moves like the Bollywood? Yeah. Can you do whoa, you're Indian. Can you do like the Bollywood dances like this? That's Jesus Christ. <laughs> I feel like I'm not even allowed to comment on what happened just now. I feel like I'm not even, that was, that was, that was kind of, that was excessive. <laughs> also, I know that the quality uh, took like a huge jump down. <laughs> That's just the video. I, I'm watching it in 1080p right now and it looks like shit. She looks like a monster right now in front of me. You've been on the state for 56 minutes. You've earned $56. You can either take the money or have a second date with me. What's your decision? I just got next to a huge celebrity. I'm gonna try. This is my rap and what? Is it good? You're like uh, really good looking. You are too. Cool. Every time someone is posed with the question of do you want to take the money or do you want to go on a second date, they have such a great flashback of the time they were on the bus and the select moments that we saw from the date and they're like they're gonna base their entire the rest of their life off of this decision i remember the time she told me i was good looking man man maybe i will go on a second date well i'm flattered that you asked me out for a second date so let me propose you <laughs> will you marry me Whoa, okay, that seemed extreme. Was not expecting him to propose to her. That wasn't one of the options. <laughs> Next was a great show. I wish there was something with this, not exactly this, but something with this energy that was like out today. I'm currently watching 90 Day Fiance with my uh, girlfriend and that show was insane. Um, maybe I'll do an episode on that. That show is insane. That show is fucking crazy. Next episode, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Probably Room Raiders, since that's in the recommended. Um, yeah, sure. Next uh, episode of this series is gonna be on Room Raiders. Uh, next video, I have no idea. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, thanks for watching. Um, if you didn't enjoy the video, thanks for watching. I am also in another video on uh, my girlfriend's channel, actually, called Siren Cove. Uh, we did a... She cooked it for me 
small town meal she grew up uh, cooking and it turned out to be a really good video. I even did the camera work for that. But yeah, if you want to see that, uh, that's going to be in the description and uh, on this video if you want to click that. But there's going to be a video coming sooner than I came with this video. But besides that, uh, thank you for watching.